Earlier on, I uploaded episode four of my developer's diary for creating my first bit of software called DoorBuddy for template creation. And I talked about one of the problems that I was facing with performance in terms of things slowing down if you had too many tracks in the list. And I've now fixed it. So here we now have 4,940 tracks loaded into DoorBuddy and I've chopped these all in a group. And when we go to change the colors, it's now updating all of them without any performance issues. And to achieve this, what I did was actually make it so it's not rendering all the tracks that are in the list, all 4,000. I've made it so now the software only renders what you see, provides a bit of a buffer on each side, and essentially it's virtualized the list. And this has really sped things up. But there's more performance that I can squeeze out of DoorBuddy, and uh, I'll work on that over the coming days. Now, the other thing I've uh, decided is that up here, the folder bar, where it creates folders in a horizontal row, I'm going to change this because if there's a lot of folders, it's not really going to look very good. So a bit like Cubase, I'm going to create a left zone here. And this is where all the folders will then populate in a vertical manner. And you'll be able to you know, rearrange things how you want. And also I'm going to add in some stuff to show and hide the different folders and also add a feature in so when you do select a folder with, with tracks inside, it will scroll through the list and automatically take you to that visually. So yes, lots of things uh, to be done, but making progress, moving forwards is what we're doing.